Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And of course, in today's tutorial, guys, I'm going to show you how to save battery on your S22 devices. This is the S22 Ultra. It will also apply to the S22 um, Plus as well as the S22. Um, this is also general tips for almost any Samsung device. Um, if you want to save battery, one of the coolest things that you can do is follow these tips. All right, so let's get straight into it. Now, the first thing you want to do, guys, if you want to save battery, is do note that these um, screens, they are able to produce almost perfect blocks. So what can happen is that um, the screen, once it's displaying block, it basically turns off the pixel. So a block uses less energy. So uh, most of the time you're on your um, background. So in most cases, I recommend that you... I recommend that you, in order to save on battery, that you go ahead and get a dark wallpaper. The blacker, the better. So if you can get a totally pitch black, which is true black um, wallpaper, go ahead and do that. Now, let me show you what I mean. Now, between this text right here, sorry, between these icons, this will be black. Be careful that it's not gray. Black means totally black. All right. So if you can get a wallpaper that has a lot of block, it will work better. Um, this is not a perfect example, but you can see that it's mainly block. So this wallpaper would allow the device, once it's set, to consume less energy. Once it consumes less energy, you'll find that um, it will save on battery life. So that's the first tip to save on um, battery life on your device. Next, and this, of course, is an easy one. Um, go into your toggle gear here. Most times you have a lot of stuff turned on that's not being used. For example, um, location services. If there's not a real reason for you to be using location services, um, turn it off. In that way, this radio will be off and it will consume less energy. Same for Bluetooth especially. It doesn't need to be on except when you're going to use Bluetooth. Um, Wi-Fi, if you're not connected to a Wi-Fi network or using the internet, go ahead and turn that off until you need it. Same for mobile data, keep it off until it's needed unless there's a true reason to have it. When you keep these off and use them as necessary, you'll find that it will save a lot on battery. Um, in case of mobile data, if you really need to get your updates and your pings, you can keep that on. But I'm just saying um, the main culprits that to keep off would be Bluetooth and location if they're not being used. Also, you can look through and... Um, turn off any other unnecessary stuff that's not being used for example another thing that can save battery that will go with the wallpaper tip is to keep your um, device in dark mode now mine is in dark mode what you can do is keep dark mode on permanently so of course if i turn this off that's dark mode light mode um, you can go to details all you can do is you can either set it to a schedule or of course continually keep your device in dark mode you can customize the schedule and keep it on or simply turn off the mode and keep it in being perpetually on so dark mode will make the menus um, dark so you can see the background and even the day if you do that it will save a lot on power by making the menus um, dark so keep your device in dark mode really is another cool tip to save on power um, another thing you can do as well guys to save more power is to use um, some of these features as well, such as extra dim. This one is mainly for nighttime use. Extra dim will turn down the display way down. And of course, it can save additional um, power. Another thing you can do, guys, is find power saving mode. As you can see, your power saving mode is a um, feature that will squeeze that much more power out of your device. It will throttle the CPU speed. It will reduce the device functionality. You might lose some performance, but of course, you'll find that it will save power. Um, you can go ahead and tap on the text. You can turn on the motor. You can go into details. And you can customize. Notice it tells you here. You can customize when it will start. It will throttle the CPU and um, help significantly in saving on battery power. So that's a convenient mode that um, Samsung has created that does everything for you. So you can use this mode. Another thing to do, guys, is to... Um, go ahead here again to save on um, power is to go here and find a brightness slider by default it's set to automatically adapt however if you find that you're working mainly inside and you do not need adaptive brightness meaning your transition in between outside and inside 
what you can do to save on power again is to turn off the adaptive feature and set the brightness to a lower setting meaning you'd keep it at a very low settings meaning anything below the um at least quarter so half is very high so keep it below um the quarter the quarter here meaning you keep it to the lower side of the spectrum this would be very good if you can keep it um, right here without having it adjust the screen will consume less energy and of course this will save significantly on um, power all right so those are the main things that you can do to um, save on power on your device um, some of the things are very intuitive such as if you have a lot of games um, control your gaming until you're around an outlet um, games do consume a lot of power and of course they burn um, up or eat up your battery life so know what consumes more power such as gaming and of course if you do these things and monitor your usage you'll find that your battery will last significantly longer all right i hope the tips were helpful and you at least learn a few ways you can use to curve your um, overall battery consumption and of course over time if you do these things you'll find that um your battery life will last way longer than normal all right guys so i'm going to end this tutorial here as always guys ricardo from blog tech tips saying bye until next time bye